Hey, COVID-19, the worst part and the best part. In this video, I'm gonna share with you what has been one of my biggest challenges with this uh, shelter and home and how I have found kind of a workaround to get through it. Hey everybody, it is Jay Crater, and uh, it's great to be here with you again this week. So um, when I work with my clients, and I've gone through this process myself many times, we look at all the possible values that somebody could, could have. You know, what's important? What's really important to each individual? Is it connecting? Is it uh, family? Is it being an artist? Is it excellence? Well, in my case, it is spirit of adventure. And when you really hit on what your core value is, man, it feels like all this wind and air blows through your heart. It's just like this, man. It's like clarity, it's pretty awesome. And you know that's why I travel so much because it is the thing that gives me the most joy, the most pleasure, uh, makes me feel the most alive. Well, of course, uh, I can't travel. <laughs> I'm like a bird in a cage. And uh, aren't we all? Can you relate to that? So that is the worst part. I was planning to go to Thailand next month. I just read Thailand is shutting down their airports to anyone coming from another country for a good while. So that's out the window. So what does somebody with the spirit of adventure as their core value do? Well, I looked up uh, in my book here, uh, chapter 21 is called Technology Hiatus. And there's a great quote here by the one and only Charles Bukowski. Uh, there is a loneliness in this world so great that you can see it in the slow movement of the hands of a clock. So what does that have to do with technology hiatus? Well, here's what it, here's what it meant to me back in 2015 and still means to me now, is that when I stop f messing around with technology, I have more time. And that allows me to see things slower. And I'm spending more time now sitting on my cushion meditating. So my spirit of adventure is now my spirit of my own inner world and connection to the spirit world. So that's how I'm dealing with it. I am creating a spirit of adventure right here, right here in this space. This is my space, right? Yeah, I've got a picture there of a nice beach and some water and I've got some pictures over there and, you know, I'm connecting with people in other countries. But, you know, it's not the same as getting on a freaking airplane <laughs> and going and really you know, being there with the people and eating the food and talking and feeling the air and the sun and, and all of that. So I'm going in, in. My spirit of adventure is taking me in. And that's my solution to get through the next month or two is uh, to, to learn more, to go inside, to uh, discover new worlds there. So that's what's going on this week. That's what's going on this week. Uh, my invitation is for you to, if you want to, you know, get clear on your values and what's really important to you and then make your actions a correlate um, of those values because that's really when you start to get into alignment and things start to click. All right. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed yet, subscribe. I do a video every single week. And uh, thank you again. I'll see you next week. Bye for now.